Ooh, here we have one of the boogeymen of the periodic table. This is arsenic. Arsenic is almost synonymous with poison. It's uh, this earthy um, looking heavy type of material um, that is not used for very many things because the body does not agree with it. It, it, it interacts at the cellular level with uh, some enzymes and, and it's bad news. Uh, however, it's not terribly poisonous. Uh, the, the poisonous effects take a long time to actually become systemically harmful, let's put it that way. And somebody correct me if, if I'm wrong, but um, based on just having it in the open air, it's not like you have to run away from it or anything. Um, it looks a little bit different here than here, and the reason why is because arsenic is uh, very reactive with oxygen. As soon as you open it from its very pure state here, it's, it's like um, 99 point 99999% pure, uh, so that's seven nines. Uh, this is used for the semiconductor industry. And here it looks much more like a metal, as you can see. It's very brittle, um, but it does look like a metal. However, once you, if you were to crack this 20 grams ampule out, the air gets inside, and after a couple hours, it'll look black like this other type we see here. Uh, it does not degrade any further, but it's not quite as attractive as you can see. Uh, arsenic is bad news once it gets into the water stream because then it does become much more poisonous uh, for wildlife and people as well. But in its pure state, if you were to have it in your collection, just keep it in a bottle and it's no big deal. Uh, you can have it buy it either this way or you can spend a little more and get it in its unoxidized state um, which is bathed constantly in argon gas so that it's not spoiled but uh, it's quite cheap to uh, have it if you don't mind it being rocky black looking stuff all right well this is Raciel for luciteria thank you for watching